everyone, Lady Phoenix here, and welcome to the finale of Crash Bandicoot Warped from the Insane Trilogy. So in the previous video, we collect all of the gems and got one on five percent, and that's lovely. In this video, I'm going to show you the fake crash locations and also the DLC for Future Tense. Now, surprisingly, I downloaded Future Tense right after I recorded Part 14, and turns out it's still free as of December of 2018. And the DLC came out back in uh, the summertime, so that's something. Now there are three locations as to where Fake Crash is located that I know of. He could be located in other levels, but these are the three that I know for sure. I actually discovered the Area 51 one uh, during the recording session of, uh, I think it was part 14, part 15, I'm not sure, but I'll show you. But here he is right there. Just turn, turn your head. He, he should turn eventually. And out of all the, that's one location. And out of all the locations that I know of personally, you do get a trophy for shooting him with the fruit bazooka, but the next level that you see him in is Making Waves, which is a Coco exclusive level, and you're on the jet ski all the time. And then the other level that I seen him in briefly was Area 51, which is a crash exclusive level. And you can only see him uh, on the left-hand side just briefly, but you can't use the Fruit Bazooka on this level or Area 51. So that's about the only level you're going to be able to shoot him in. Like I said, to my this is to my knowledge. This is back in my um, old school memory because these are the exact same lo levels and locations he was in in the original. He, like I said, he may be in other levels. I'm just not sure. Oh shit! Well, <laughs> whatever. Uh, since I want to kind of save time, I don't want to drag this video up video out for too long I'm just gonna go ahead and cut ahead until I get to the location of where he's located which shouldn't take me long there he is okay welcome back there he is again you get a better look at him uh, in this level there he is with his bad teeth I could have yeah he does have a unibrow <laughs> you can see it more when he turned he should turn yeah Oh, no, he doesn't. He just has very bad eyebrows. <laughs> but, yep, that's his uh, second location. And then I'll meet you guys in Area 51, uh, where you can see him briefly on the left-hand side. So see you guys in a bit. There we go. There he is. Like I said, I don't even remember him being in the original but he's definitely in this one. I don't know, I could be wrong. The original was so damn dark, you couldn't even tell. But those are the fake crash locations that I know of. If it's more, please let me know in the comment section. But those are the two, well, three that I know. The third one I just learned until <laughs> recently in the Insane Trilogy. Like I said, Area 51 wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be because PS4 and the back, uh, graphics and stuff was enhanced but it was still a pain now in order to access future tests you of course you got to first download it then hop on this here think about what's it and here you go you're at future tense and I already got the relic as you can see and I got gold not platinum yeah 115 and then for platinum they want freaking 52 seconds get the hell out of here <laughs> All right, so Future Tense is like Kaizo Mario. <laughs> I was like, it's so much going on in this damn level. Okay, guys, welcome back. All right, so there's a reason why I'm saying welcome back. One, because the guy across the street was being obnoxious with this motorcycle and was just being loud throughout the whole video. And well, not the throughout the whole video, the, the throughout the entire time that I was here in Future Tense. Two, um, I can't, I keep dying in this level. <laughs> I'm not really good at this level. I don't like this level, to be honest. I mean, it's not a bad level, it's just 
part. <laughs> uh, but uh, the second reason is that you can't die in this level because there's a death root in this level. Yeah, oh joy. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is uh, definitely a good level to do a DLC on. 145 boxes. That does include uh, uh, what you would call it, a bonus round as well. Now you want to go ahead and do a double jump. Didn't know I can do a double jump. I thought you had to use the boxes, but go ahead and do a double jump and come over here in this area. Make sure you get these boxes and do make sure you do shoot that um, exclamation point because obviously it's going to be useful later. Now, if I die again on this part right here, oh, you know what? There's regular boxes in the death route, so I will have to restart it. Damn it! That's how they get you. But then, but it's weird because usually when there's regular boxes, the master nitro switch is uh, in the death route. But in this case, it's not. It's just the regular gem and regular boxes. Whatever. But anyway, you definitely want to take your time. Take your time with this level, because this level is throwing everything at you. One thing I will say is that I like how the level uses uh, the reflection. I think that is so awesome. Also, it does make you utilize your fruit bazooka a little bit uh, more often. And the previous levels didn't really make you use it a lot. But in this level, it kind of does make you use it. Okay, wait. Okay, I was just being sure. Jump up here. And this is this will take you to the death room. So, yay, I suppose. <laughs> Be careful. Okay, because you don't, as soon as you jump on that, you don't want to spin into that. Okay, this one. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. I was like, oh my god, I don't want to hit get hit that thing. Okay, we're doing good. I'm not gonna lie, palms are sweaty. Okay, no, hit it, crash. There we go. All right. Oh god. <laughs> Matter of fact, can I? Get, yeah, I was just about to say, can I just kill you? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Take your time. If you got to, just use your run. Ooh, all right, there we go. Okay, now the death root, like I said, is obnoxious and there is a checkpoint inside of it so you don't have to go through all that crap again. And I should have went. That wasn't too difficult. Shoot down these guys and make sure you shoot that rotating box because it will turn solid on you. And you don't want that to happen. Oh, I was about to say. <laughs> I thought it wasn't going to flip over at time. I was about to cry. I was about to say, Mama, no. Oh, it stopped. Oh, can I get you from here? I can. <laughs> oh, wait. No, I can't. Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. It looks like I can. Yes, I can. <laughs> oh, can I? Oh, Lord. I do not feel comfortable. Okay, there we go. All right, now I can get through this comfortable. Comfortable. Okay. Now be careful because there is going to be another... Oh, let me see if I can get the trophy. Darn it, darn it. Okay, whatever. I'll probably have to get that off screen. Oh! Okay, that's okay. Thankfully, these explosions here don't uh, interfere with one another. All right. I don't think that uh, enemy right there in the center, uh, I don't think he... Uh, what am I trying to say? I don't think he... Ooh! I don't think he... Uh, Frick. I don't think he, uh, I don't think those spikes uh, go down. So just do a death tornado spin. Okay. 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 
Yeah, that guy over there, that little mech guy over there, he's gonna keep shooting no matter what. So, I'm trying to get to this box without getting hit. Okay, there we go, there we go. All right. I can't take the chance. Oh, there goes Fake Crash. Ha! <laughs> hey, buddy. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Ha, <laughs> ha. That's cool. I did not realize, recognize him over there. I didn't realize he was over there. That's cool. I did not know that. All right. Well, how appropriate. All right, let me just, I'm just gonna slide jump, death tornado spin all over this crap. Okay. Then I hope this enemy did not re. Okay, I think we're good. We're good. Take your time. Okay, don't do that. Okay. Okay, take your time. Take your time. Because you don't want to do all that over again. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I was about to say, I have no idea what this drop off. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, now I can relax a little bit. <laughs> now I don't have to go through all that again. So pretty much it's just straightforward from here. The only thing you may struggle a little bit on is the bonus round because the bonus round requires you to be a little bit quick with uh, how you proceed with uh, doing that. So that's all. But other than that, it's pretty straightforward. And, okay, I can get up there. Okay, let's go ahead and clear this bonus round first because I'm pretty sure I am going to screw this up. Boom, okay. Come on, get the... Oh, shit. Yep, I screwed it up already. <laughs> what you got to do is not shoot the TNT. You got to make it to where it's a solid crate. And... They gave me my Budoka Budoka bat. That was very generous of them. <laughs> there we go. Damn it. I thought it was going to change, and it didn't change. But you got to make it into a solid crate. And hurry up and get in the opening. That one I can do just fine. It's this one. There we go. Before all that blows up. And then you gotta slide in. And then you want you wanna hurry up and take care of this. <laughs> well that wasn't supposed to happen, but I got to. <laughs> Hopefully you got Aku Aku just in case you screw that up. Okay, get up there, Crash. Oh god. All right, then go through like so, and then you're good. These nitros is a trip, to be honest with you. They pop up when they want to. Want to. They're obnoxious. <laughs> All right, and that's done. Good. Now we gotta come up here, because I think it's two or three boxes that I need to get. Oh God, okay. Ooh, I got it just in time. And that I don't, it's nothing else over there. And I'm surprised I made that. Okay, whatever, <laughs> I'm not complaining. 25 more boxes. I swear if I do myself the way I did Bud Light, oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. I honestly don't know what box I missed the very first time I did it. <laughs> I really don't. There we go. You got to use that uh, enemy in order to get that uh, the en enemy reflection in order to get that box. There's a box right here. Oh yeah, I remember. Okay. I was like, wait a minute, I'm drawing a blank on this one. I remember, be careful, do not hold the X button when getting that because it's a guy right there and he'll hurt you. 
My God, I really need to learn how to put this phone on vibrate. Oh, shit. You know what? I screwed up. <laughs> I was thinking, I don't know what the hell I was thinking. I was thinking of the wrong reflection. Oh, yeah, that was stupid on so many levels. It'll probably be easier if I just die. But you got to use the reflection to show you where this area is at. And I was thinking of the wrong... Fuck. <laughs> Oops. I was thinking of the wrong freaking reflection. That was my fault. And I knew it was a TNT in here, but I didn't think I was that freaking close to it. Yeah, they kind of get you with these reflections. It's a nice addition. Don't get me wrong, but darn. <laughs> got me. See if I can just... Oh, that did not work out the way I wanted it to. <laughs> I know that guy is just laughing at that thing. Just taunting me. Like, ha 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 ha. Alright, we're going to try this again now. I'm not great at this game. And I'm really not great at this DLC. Oh, God. That did not work out the way I wanted it to. We're going to do it again, like for sure, for realsies this time. <laughs> oh my, oh yeah, I'm doing great. Okay, that works out even more. I was kind of scared. Okay. Whew. Whew. Oh, Lord. Why didn't I kill that thing? Send away. Go away. <laughs> all right. I'm not doing all that all over again. Now. We're going to take our time because I'm not going through all that. <laughs> I want to say it's one more checkpoint. I hope it's one more checkpoint because I don't want to go through all that all over again. <laughs> There we go. Actually, I think I just used the last checkpoint. Yeah, I did. Damn it. Be careful. All right. More likely, you're going to use this Boudicca Boudicca right here because I have yet. Woo! I don't even know how I made that, but I did it. <laughs> Do I care? No, nah, not really. All right, one more box and it's an extra life. Okay, it's, I think it's on the next, uh, yeah, there it go, right down there. Damn it. Okay, I did not expect to bounce. Okay, <laughs> okay. that's okay. Oh yeah, sure. Give me a pity, why don't you? It doesn't help me against bottomless pits, just saying. Cause that's my issue here. That works too, okay. As a matter of fact, can I just... Thank you. Now was that hard? No, it wasn't. Was, why was I making it hard? Mm -hmm. There we go. Good God Almighty. <laughs> I got both the gems. Yay. Yay. And I got my trophy. The other trophy you get by just driving on, uh, shooting one of those UFO guys that come in through the left and the right of the screen. And that's it. But, yeah, I don't need to show you guys that. But that's it for Crash Bandicoot Warped Insane Trilogy. It's been fun dealing with Crash, but it's time to put him away and, you know, maybe uninstall him because I ain't got no room on PS4. <laughs> I'm sorry, Crash. Don't look at me like that. But uh, that's it for this Let's Play. And if you would like to see more Let's Plays or weekend walkthroughs from the channel, please be sure to click on the links in the description below. But until then, until the next Let's Play, 
which the next Crash Bandicoot game that I will do is Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex, uh, which is on the PS2, GameCube, and Xbox, and I'm going to be using the GameCube version, but it's probably going to be a while before I get to that, just to take a break from Crash Bandicoot games in general. Uh, so yeah, that will be the next Crash game. But until the next Crash game or another Let's Play or a weekend walkthrough, uh, you guys take care and have an awesome day.